Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we are at TJ Maxx and they have so much Christmas decor. So get comfortable. And if you love to shop, please subscribe, click the notification bell, share with your friends and let's shop. So starting out with this display right here, which had a whole bunch of different things on it, but this Santa caught my attention and I had to go ahead and dig him out. I had to take a good look. Do you see the Santa? He is ready for the beach. He has his bucket of ice, his surfboard. He is ready so cute love that santa now we're moving on to all of the throw pillows and throw blankets look at how much stuff they have it's an entire row i mean they always have it like this but so many so i'm going through here just kind of pointing out trying to take a look at what's the best pretty much what I think, like basically what caught my attention. This one that says family with the ticking stripe. So cute. This is a ticking stripe, right? Is that what that's called? Even when they're thick like that? I know the smaller stripes like this are called ticking stripes, but I think those are too. Correct me if I'm wrong. Let me know. And so, yeah, I'm just look at this one with the cats. How cute is that? so cute not that i'm like a huge cat lover or anything but i do think that that's really cute and then of course look at what i dug out the gnomes yes it is all about the gnomes we've talked about this in other videos gnomes are taking over this year gnomes are doing it Speaking of gnomes, now here is a throw blanket. I'm telling you, it's all about the gnomes. It's the year of the gnome, as I like to say. <laughs> so here is this blanket. It's cute, right? It's cute. Those gnomes look like they're going somewhere. They look like they're marching, go walking somewhere. This one is also cute. Same thing here. Navy blue. Yes. Please and thank you so nice and then this one with the gray though that one was different and cool but yeah same thing over here i'm just kind of pointing out pulling out the ones that are catching my attention worth showing you but of course i mean they have so many i can't actually show every single little item look at that one with those tassels yes so good and then my favorite was actually this one. How pretty is this with the green and the trees? Very nice. And then over here on this display, they have the bed sheets. So cool. I have never changed my bed sheets for Christmas. Look at this one with the string of lights. So cute. Love it. And the, the dog. He's so cute also. So the string of lights, the dogs just makes it that much better. I'm dropping things over here, but no worries. I pick it up. If I drop something, I pick it up. I try to put everything back the way that I found it. Love this one with the wreath. So cute. Yeah, that one is really nice. I lost my train of thought for a second. I was actually going to ask you, do you change your sheets for Christmas? Like, do you get Christmas themed sheets? I would love to know. Let me know in the comments. I might want to do that maybe. Look at this one. I feel like that one met first. Uh, okay, I'm all over the place. This one with the blue, love. But that one with the white and the green trees, doesn't that match that throw pillow we just saw? totally matches i thought that was very nice and i was like "Ooh, i might want to do that i might want to get that i didn't get it while i was there so you know what that means i mean it's a luck game if i might go back and it might not even be there anymore these are the tablecloths they had lots of them and then they also had lots and lots of kitchen towels this one right here is really cute with the truck and the 
I guess the different vehicles. This one, love. So cute. I love, I'm telling you, I've told you before, I love anything with the row of houses. And that one is really nice. And it was Kate Spade. So very nice. Now here are the table runners, but there was one random apron. So I figured I would show it to you. And the same thing here table runners i'm pulling out the ones that caught my attention this one is super nice i love the santa belt situation i mentioned this in my dollar tree video one of the dollar tree videos i can link the playlist for you so you can go and watch that if you would like to do that but they also have a few things the bows and a sign they have a few things that is just that design of the santa belt and I really like that. That table runner that I just put back, that burlap look with all the little green trees, so cute. And look at this one, farm fresh Christmas trees at the bottom, burlap, yes, love. This was probably my favorite one. Then this one with the snowflakes, very cute and fancy, I like it. And by the way, the prices, did you see the price of that other one? $12.99. Like these prices are not bad. These were all $19.99 or under, which is very nice. Love this one too, of course. It has a green wreath. My favorite. Love it. And then this one at the end. At the end. Let me let me speak clearly. <laughs> but it's so bold, all this black what very nice like it's a lot of black and very i don't know i feel like it's so bold but i like it here are the tree skirts they have a nice selection and my favorite is this one right here it is so like nice and full and then the fact that it has the pom-poms on the back that was my favorite i think that's such a cute little touch back there i mean some trees you might not even see that part but so what you know it's there it's good love now here we are at that section where they put all of the different things all of the things, all of the Christmas decor, randomness, the signs, all the things. Here's a little Ray Dunn. Can't go into a TJ Maxx without a little Ray Dunn in the mix. And I was trying to figure out, was this Christmas or not? I mean, I guess it is, but it says USA. So I don't know. I was a little confused by that. This little tray, so cute. This whole collection of this brand is very nice and like fancy. This little set of bowls, I think it's so cute. And then these canisters that kind of really, it doesn't match exact, but kind of goes well with it. Really nice, love it, even though I don't do red like that. So here is this brand again. I mean, is it is the brand Christmas tree or is it that other word spode? Am I saying that right? I don't even know. But this is that the one that I was saying like seems kind of fancy. This little ornament is so cute and it didn't have the price. That little Christmas box. So nice. And now some Santas for all of the Santa lovers. Here are some Santas. They had a nice little variety for a TJ Maxx. You know, they're not going to have like as many as a Hobby Lobby, let's say, but or even the at-home store. But they have some. And this one is pretty cool. And then they also had it with this different hat and cape. Like the first one is more grayish blue. And then the second one was a little more greenish. And that one is of of course as you can see it was like the nautical santa these are so cute look at this santa who is playing baseball 
so cute but he couldn't see and then i noticed that they had some more in the back they you know you know how it is at tj maxx they pack it all in and make it hard for me to get things out and then i kind of tend to almost drop everything or i will drop everything so i was doing the best i could but i really wanted to show you all of the santas You see what I mean? Look at this mailbox back there. Green and it's a countdown and it's like hiding in the back. Unfortunately, I could not get to it to see how much it was, but it is there. So if you're looking for that, check out your TJ Maxx. They have all of the things. That's why I said this is the section with like all of the random Christmas decorations. There's like no rhyme or reason. It's all over here. And why not? We'll take it. Look at this little gnome hiding in the back. So cute. All of the bottle brush trees. Here they are. All different sizes, varieties, colors, prices. And then I didn't realize this is a trio. It's like a one thing. At first I thought it was individual ones, but it is not. And then look at these little guys. How cute are these? They're not gnomes. They're not Santas. What are they? What are these little guys? Please comment below. Let me know. Never seen them before. Are they just little kids? No, I'm not sure. Please let me know. First time seeing those. And then this is heavy. That's why I was doing that. And it's so nice. I really like this. And it was heavy. So I couldn't really truly lift it up. Now here is a snow globe. Now here is the infamous plate. We have discussed this plate in another video at length. I asked, what is this little plate for? So many of you have commented and I've gotten a variety of things that it's for i think the winner though is cranberry sauce i believe that is the answer i got the most and then followed by that would be uh nuts and some people also said mints but i really do think it probably is for cranberry sauce here's another row of houses and they're wood so cute you know i love it lots of reindeers in many different colors and then those trees back there the candy trees, love. Here are more of these little canister thingies and another mailbox in the back. That one is actually even bigger than the green one. Again, couldn't get to it, sorry about that. And then here are some really nice coasters. I really like these coasters. I thought they were so nice. And there's one particular one that is my favorite, and that is this one right here. So good. These angels are so beautiful and they have so many of them. So if you're looking for these, TJ Maxx has them. They're so nice. I love them. I love the ones dressed in white better than the ones dressed in red, but they're all really, really nice. The ones with like the two, look at the one back there with the heart and the two little pom-poms in the hair, the two ponytails, 
so nice her little dress is like iridescent so good love those and then we go from angels to a nautical santa Here's the Olaf cup again. We last saw him in the home goods video. This Santa, I wanted to show again. I briefly showed him before, but I saw him again and I realized like, oh my gosh, he's so cute. He is cooking, he is Chef Santa, and he is making all of the gingerbread. Thank you, Santa. Now here are their stockings. Look at this one. It's a pack of two, right? That's a pack of two. I didn't really realize it while I was in the store, but then when I was watching the video back, I'm like, that's a pack of two. That's pretty good. And you, they actually had enough for you to make like a set of four or even six if you need six. Because I always talk about the fact that like Marshalls, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, they always have really cool stockings that you might not be able to find anywhere else, but it's hard to actually match them up for like four or five. It seems like they always have like one or two of something, but they actually had a nice variety and like a good amount of them. So check out your TJ Maxx sooner than later because we all know all of these things, all of the Christmas things will be selling out very quickly. This Santa was also very cool. And here is his price. It was on the other side. He is $60. Here are more of the gnomes. The gnomes are not stopping. It is their year and they are here to stay. And these are the Ray Dunn ones. Some of them say joyful, love. I thought that was cool. I like that their hats are that plaid with the gray. So that's cool. Now here is a really super cool card holder, like a Christmas card holder. So good, wood, $20. It comes with the little clips and the star on top. Love that. Now here's a different one, same concept. It's a tree, but it's a little bit different. Also $20. I really like these and they have it in green also, right in there. And then they had that other different looking one as well very cute really like those now we're going into the world of the wreaths and just like that one garland over there this wreath is so beautiful so realistic i love it the red berries like the greenery is so good i love it even though again I don't do the red berries like I don't do a lot of red not that I don't do the red berries I do sometimes but it's so beautiful by the way I didn't show it but I dropped it I couldn't get the price it was a whole to do that's why I was kind of like please stay the struggle is real in the background of what goes on when I'm in the stores <laughs> seriously this tiny little one love so cute
got these gigantic, and I am not exaggerating this time. <laughs> these things are huge. They are so big. These are the biggest ones I've ever seen. You get two for 30, and then the other one was also 30, but you got six, I believe it was. Wow. I was like, this is crazy, but they're so cool. These are supposed to light up, but they did not light up for me. They don't have a lot of the hanging ornaments, but they did happen to have Gamecocks and of course, Clemson. Okay, with this one, I was trying to figure out what it was. At first I thought it was a garland and then I realized these are ornaments. These are little fluffy ornaments, like little pom-pom ornaments. So cute, love those. This garland is so beautiful and it lights up, super cute. I think it would be so great like in a baby's room or a smaller child's room. That's the vibes that that garland is giving me. And then they had these like four ornament boxes that are super nice. Again, these are like the types of ornaments that you're not necessarily going to find everywhere and beautiful. So they have this Merry and Bright stocking holder. It kind of reminds me of the Merry Christmas one at Target. And the first one is gold. And then the ones in the back are silver. And the ones with the silver have a little gnome versus the gold one had a little tree there. So just wanted to point that out. It does remind me of the one from Target. This set of ornaments is super beautiful. This was one of my favorite boxes that I saw while I was there. So, so pretty. Love all the green. This one, Baby's First Christmas, loved it so much. I wish it was pink. I wish it didn't have like all the blue. I want it to be pink. I need one in pink. And I was so disappointed that they didn't have it in pink. I hope to find it somewhere else in pink because I love like the calligraphy, the writing on there, the font, all of the different names for the writing. <laughs> but yeah, I love that one. I just need it to be in pink. Here is the wrapping paper. 
and they had so much i don't think i've ever seen so much wrapping paper at a tj maxx before like they are going all out on the wrapping paper this green with polka dots love so good that's one of my favorites the christmas tree yes please and thank you of course and then this one with this writing also so good i mean pretty much I love all of the ones that I'm pulling out. That's why I'm pulling them out because I feel like those were the ones that caught my eye, the ones that were like worth giving a closer look to. Here's that ticking stripe. Don't forget to tell me if that's what that's called. Is it even ticking? Is it ticking stripe? I might even be saying that part wrong. I don't know. Please educate me on that if I am wrong. Look at this vintage mouse. I almost forgot his name. <laughs> Mickey Mouse. Vintage. Love. So good. All of the paper with the Christmas tree. I love it. Here's the elf one. Call classic. Even though I've never seen the movie. <laughs> yes, I have never seen the elf movie. I'm going to try to make it a movie that I watch this Christmas season. There's more of the ticking stripe. Ho hope I'm saying that right. <laughs> That one is in the red. So they have it in red and in the like gray or black stripe. And of course, another favorite, the string of lights. Beautiful, love it. And then this one, so cute. Donut gingerbread, love that one. This is such a cool idea. I love that they did this. I've seen stuff like this before, but I never seen it with coffee. So it's like the 12 days of Christmas of like different coffee. And apparently they also have it for tea as well. And then that one is for um, meat flavor. So it's like um, hot sauces, I believe that one was, the one that was laying down really really cool stuff they have all of the things check out your tj maxx as you can see this video of course is super long if you're still here thank you so much i appreciate you i just had to show all of the things i figured you would want to see all the things why not it is christmas it is time to start shopping for this stuff like i already mentioned it is all going to sell out super fast so i wanted to bring it all to you in one video so you can like see if they have the things that you want anything you're weren't even thinking of getting maybe this is giving you some ideas but thank you for being here i appreciate that and if you haven't subscribed please do so if you've been with me for this time all the way to this point in the video just go ahead and hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell share the video with your friends and how cute is that bottle topper and right into my favorite seinfeld what this set of cups is everything <laughs> how good is this who is a Seinfeld fan? Let me know. Festivus for the best of us. Yes. He, George Costanza's father was the best. Like so many good lines. He was such a great part of that show. He was really a great part of any show he was on. Really. But yeah, let me know if you're a Seinfeld fan. Love that show. That's where I got... Okay, so let me say this, just in case you're new or you haven't seen a lot of my videos, usually when I say, the ribbon, who doesn't want to wear the ribbon? That's from Seinfeld. It's a cult classic episode, even though I think the entire show is a cult classic episode. <laughs> Okay, I thought I was gonna be quiet for a second, but there's just too many good things in this section. How good is that tea, little teapot thing? And then it comes with the fancy teas inside. So good, I love that it's clear glass. And then look at this little set back here. Yes, a little fancy tea party for two. 
Yes, please. Please and thank you. Tea with the queen, if you will. <laughs> I've been, I've watched that show, um, The Queen. Is that what it's called? On Netflix? That show is so good. I highly recommend it, by the way, if you haven't watched it. But that's what that reminds me of. It's like tea with the queen with your fancy little teacup and such. Very cool. Now, here are these baking sets. So nice. These spatulas are so cute. They're all the things. And they come with a cookie cutter. This Mickey Mouse mitten. So good. Look at the gingerbread. All of them. They're all really, really good. Like I said, they come with a little cookie cutter. But my very favorite are these sets. These are so cool. This one only... No, that one does have four. For a second, I thought it only had two cookie cutters. It has four. And then the little rolling pin. And then the design on the side. So good. But you're about to see my favorite if you don't already see it. This is a sifter. So nice. Like, this whole section was giving me all the baking vibes. Even though I'm not a baker. How good is this? With the houses and this one comes with a whisk i also like that about this set i'd rather have the whisk and the spatula love so now we're in the world of the cards and the candles lots and lots of candles actually so many that one was fireside this one is gingerbread i cannot tell you whether they smell well well <laughs> whether they smell good or not because i i wasn't smelling them then they had that little tiny fireside one that we just went through sand and fog i believe is supposed to be a pretty i always hear people talk about it being a good brand of candles at tj maxx and home goods and marshalls and such so that might be a good one and then these cards they have beautiful beautiful cards again things that you're not going to find everywhere like you're probably not going to have the same card as someone else um i mean anything is possible i suppose but you know probably not so yeah they had lots of cards lots of candles and i'm sure some of these candles you might even be able to tell me which one of these candles actually smell good i'm not I don't usually buy candles there, so I'm not sure. Now take a look at this card. It is so funny. It says, it's Christmas, fake smiles, everyone. And did you see their faces? I thought that card was hilarious. So good. Now here are some of the gift bags. They have little baby Yoda up top. I always notice little baby Yoda. Lots and lots of these curly Q bows. And then some of my favorites are actually these little canvas bags. These ones right here. These are super cute. They come in a pack of two and they had a nice little selection of them. That one is trying to give me all types of issues and wasn't letting me get it out of the little hook. <laughs> but yeah here they are the penguin is so cute with his little wreath around his neck very very cute and then of course the wine bottle bags love and these are canvas did i mention that they're canvas bags and then they also had these big sacks and the gnomes made it on to these i love their little pom-pom hats super cute i thought that was very nice love these and a little bell so good so nice and that is going to be it for this video thank you so much for watching if you are still here at the very end of the video thank you so so much i hope you enjoyed please give it a thumbs up and i would love it if you continue to watch even though you just watched the longest video ever <laughs> by clicking on one of these videos right here on the screen and I will see you in the next one. Bye!